on to the Lord. Does anybody want to feel God today in a powerful way? That's what I came for. I didn't come just to have social hour. I like being with you. I like being around you. But I didn't come just to socialize. I came to be in the presence of God. I came to have his spirit bless me today. I believe you can have the same. You'll get out of the service what you put in. Oh, come on, somebody, hear me. Yeah. I'm going to say that again. You'll get out of the service what you put in. You want to yeah. put some worship in. You want to put some praise in. You want to throw in a hallelujah. You want to throw in a praise God. See what the Lord will do. In Jesus' name.
give myself to you. My life is not my own. To you I belong. I give myself, I give Somebody myself give right to you. Surrendering to God. right now just for a few moments to give yourselves right now just raise your hands close your eyes and just give yourselves to him as you pray as you love him just surrender yourself to him in praise and worship the Holy Ghost will move in this place you'll begin to circulate all over this place you'll begin to feel the love of God as we come together in love right now in one mind in one accord saying I'm gonna love the Lord with all my heart with all my soul with all my strength in Jesus' name. That's it, church. That's it, church. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Oh, Jesus. I give myself to you, Lord. How many realize that this body is just on loan? It's not really mine. It's not my own. Hallelujah. Feel his presence. Love his presence. Love him. Hallelujah.
you love the Lord, somebody clap on to God. If you felt the presence of the Lord, clap on to God. If you like what you feel, clap on to God. I believe the Lord has a whole lot more in store for this church. Praise God. Praise God. Praise God. How many believe God is mighty? Yeah. Oh, I don't know if you know, I got a mighty God. Oh, he's mighty. He is mighty in Jesus' name. Oh, praise God. Praise God.
I know you feel something. I, I know you feel what I feel. You're in the same place that I'm at. You're in the same building with the same God. I know you're feeling what I'm feeling right now. Praise God. Praise God. I tell you what I feel right now is better than any bottle of liquor. It's better than any cigarette. It's better than any joint, any cocaine. It don't matter. It's better than all that. Ain't no drug better than my Holy Ghost. Praise God. And the best part about it is it's free. No correction. You got to give up your sin. That's the one cost. And your sin's killing you anyway, so get rid of it. But it's free. Praise God. I'm telling you, there's people out there just don't get it. They don't get it. They're, they're missing out on the freedom of all this for a bunch of junk that's killing them. You know what it makes me want to do? It makes me want to dance. It makes me want to shout. It makes me want to get down for the Lord. Yeah. Somebody 
just shout the name of Jesus. Woo! <laughs> oh, that's what I'm talking about. Praise God. Praise God. Now that's the kind of praise my God deserves. That's the kind of praise. Right there. Right there. That's the cool. Ha ha. Oh, hallelujah. Hallelujah. From now on, we give any less than right there, we're not doing enough. Praise God. Praise God. Yes, God. Yes, God. If I was you, I would say, yes. Woo! Praise God. Praise God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. <laughs> Woo! I like what I feel in here today. I'm ready for church now. You warmed up? <laughs> you stretched out? You got some spiritual muscles stretched, ready to have church. You may be seated <laughs> for a moment if you can. Uh, we were singing that song. I'm going to go back. Hold on. Just, we were singing that song, and something hit me right when, where was it? It was the last, that one, right? That song. Mighty to say. It says, take me as you find me. Whew. All my fears and failures. Who that hit me right in my heart. Just reaching out to God. Feel, feel my life again. You know what I feel right now? I feel filled. I feel my life is filled right here, right now. I'm going to give my life. Everything I believe in, I'm going to surrender to you, God. I'm telling you, when we sing them songs, they're anointed. And they're not just for us to sit here and play choir. It's for us to bring the worship to God. And look what happened when we do it. Can I get an amen? Somebody just clap. One more. <laughs> Praise God. <laughs> I'm looking out there at all y'all. And look at what I know this church used to look like before we rented it. I visited several times. And this is beautiful to see what I see right now. Amen. All likes, all places, all nations, all creeds, all colors. Multicultural Jesus name church. It's beautiful. There's nothing better for a pastor to see a congregation full of people worshiping God, praising God, raising their hands onto God. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. It just touched my heart to know where I've been and know the failures that I've had. Yeah, could you kids, I mean, y'all have to sit on each other's laps. There's a pew right here. They just feel love. They just want to sit together all on top of each other. Praise God. I'm going to tell you something. Them kids are impressing me more and more every day. I'm just grateful for this church. I'm grateful to be your pastor. If you're visiting, I'm grateful that you're here today. You're in the right place. It's no mistake that you're here. Praise God. Sister Hughes, what's your daughter's name? Amber. Could you just welcome Amber? Amber, will you raise your hand? We're so glad you and your son came today. <laughs> Praise the Lord. Oh, look at that little brown baby. Got me all excited because I'm getting ready to have one myself. Praise God. A little preview. <laughs> Praise God. Remember, we have free food and fellowship first Sunday coming up. Uh, I've checked the cards. You think I don't check? I check. I stacked those cards up a week or two ago, and there's not many missing. So we need to go ahead and get some more of them cards. Take them out to wherever you go. Invite people. People love food. Everybody's got to eat. So what a perfect time. It's our one uh, outreach that we do every single month. We've been doing it regularly for years and years. It's really effective. We're excited about it. I need to know who's going to be at prayer and who's going to be at Bible experience on Tuesday. Raise your hand. We've had about 10 people last week. It was good. I'm looking for a few more. If you don't know what it is, the Bible experience, who has trouble? Everybody put your hands down for a second. I'm going to see how many honest people we have in church today. Who has trouble reading their Bible sometimes? The rest of y'all lying. You don't have no trouble reading your Bible? No, I'm, let me rephrase that. Do you always understand everything that you're reading? No, no you don't. No, I don't know anybody that does. 
Praise God. So what we do is we come together and we read the Bible. We put it over the speakers and there is a Bible experience uh, CD and it's awesome. It brings the Bible to life. It has music and background sounds and, and it, they read the scripture. We read along with it. Uh, it's an exciting time. Even myself, I learn things all the time as we're reading together. So uh, we do that on Tuesdays at 7.30. We have prayer at 6 to 7.00. 